So this is Alski's first time playing Would You Rather with us. So Alski, there's no wrong answers here. And if you guys want to discuss your answers, that's fine. If not, that's fine too. So here we go with Would You Rather. And uh, Danica, you can read the first one. All right, I'll kick it off. All right, Would You Rather collaborate a new album with Eddie Murphy or collaborate a new album with Dennis Leary? Oh, I already know my answer, Alan, you go. I, I'm gonna go, wow, that is a great question. I love Eddie Murphy, but I'm gonna go Leary. Oh, Ooh. fair. I have a confession and, I, and I'm, I'm gonna sound super negative. I can't stand Dennis Leary. I yeah. can't stand him. I just, uh, he just always. He's a long time watcher. Sorry, Dennis. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't stand, I just can't, he, he's just, he's, he puts me in a bad mood because he's always complaining about it. Well, he is an asshole. But he com no, but the way he complains is so it's, well. It's funny, but he just, he just puts me in a bad mood. Eddie Murphy, come on, man. Eddie is like. That SNL where he came back after all those years was probably the best <laughs> SNL of good. all time. It was so good. Uh, He's still so funny. He okay. never lost his funny. Like, um, yeah. See, okay, you're I looking at it from a different perspective. I, I'm looking at no, no, no. I, I think it would be fun to write lyrics with Dennis Leary. Party all the time. My girl wants to party My all the time. Party all the time. The problem is that he took Rick himself James seriously with that song. Agreed. <laughs> I would love to do My Girl Wants to Party All the Time Part 2. She's still partying. And I'll play bass instead of Rick James. There you go. Maybe. <laughs> I think that would be awesome. There we go. Matt Novetsky, Ooh. bitch. There you go. All right. So, uh... <laughs> <laughs> exactly. All right. Here's the next one. Would you rather have to tattoo the cover art of the very first album you bought on yourself or get a tattoo portrait of the lead actor from the last TV show you watched? So their face on your body or album cover on your body. That's easy for me because my first album that I ever bought was a Van Halen Oh, so fair. and the last show I watched, which is uh, yeah, uh, what is the Spanish princess on stars? So, uh, I don't even know the lead actress's name, and no, I would not want her tattooed on my body. Van Halen, <laughs> classic, Van Halen wins hand, hands down. The first album I ever bought was Michael Jackson Thriller, actually. So, I think that would be pretty awesome to have. Tattooed. Pretty I'd like a, a huge on my back. Michael oh, yeah. with the little tiger across yeah. your shoulder blade. But it needs to be sideways so you can lay down. And <laughs> <laughs> That's not creepy at all, man. I think that I think that would be awesome, actually. But I love Eugene Levy. Oh, I'm a yeah. huge fan. Very, oh, yeah. Huge fan. Yeah. Shit's Way better Creek than Dennis. That show, Shit's Creek, is so funny. It's oh, oh, it's so good. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's brilliant. Love it. All right. Here's the next one. Danica? All right. Would you have to, would you rather have to wear toe shoes for every performance oh my God. or wear Crocs for every performance? This might be the best question I've ever been asked in my life. Oh, oh great. Man. Oh, man. Um, you know, myself on the really Matt, you want to go first on this one? I'm going to go first. I would rather wear Crocs because I feel like if you're wearing Crocs, people are just going to know that you're kidding. If you wear the toe shoes, people might, they'll be like, oh, wait a minute, maybe he really... Maybe he really likes that. You know what I mean? It's more obvious that you're kidding with the Crocs, I think. So, yeah, I would embrace is that, it. Is that, okay. Maybe. I feel like if it was like a really bright color, like if they're like neon green Crocs or tie-dye yeah. Crocs. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, I don't think I can play in Crocs, but um, I have to admit that I actually have some of those Firem Toe shoes that I've oh, This is over. I'm leaving. Um, I, this was like... 15 years ago or whenever they first came out, I bought them for river shoes. Sure. Uh-huh. Uh I did. I bought them for river shoes. They worked great. Uh, I never wore them in public though, but mm. yeah. mm -hmm. Interesting. Okay. We're learning a lot here, folks. All right. All right. Here, here's the next one. Uh, would you rather have to write a concept album about potty training or write a concept album about serial killers? Serial killers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love true crime. I like oh, that. Same. Yes. Me too. I think I would go with I like true crime, but I would go with potty training. I think that would be a lot of fun. Dude, we could do shitstorm. We could. <laughs> New meaning. I think it would be really fun. Like you could like name all the different poops and um you could make little poop characters and 
Oh man, that would I'm, I might even just do this now. Just kind <laughs> I mean, of, that's, like, that's I'm kind of inspired it. right now. We're kind uh, of maybe, hey, my girl likes to potty all the time. Potty all the time. <laughs> oh man. Well, you can ride in the same yeah. murky, dude. That's so good. Oh, wow. <laughs> all, right. That's, all right. That's pretty impressive. <laughs> I love that. That was very quick, Alski, even though you still wear those weird shoes. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> next one. Would you rather have to use a naked mole rat as your logo or have to use a blobfish as your logo? Oh, man. This is, this what is naked mole what is Those are real. Those are real creatures. Are things, <laughs> those are real things. Yep. Mm -hmm. Those are real. I think, wow. the, I think we could spin the mole. I think we could spin it into something. <laughs> it reminds me it of Fallout. Sexy. The mole oh. reminds me of Fallout. Um, yeah. I'm with Alan. I think that the I think the that blobfish is just freaking me out, man. It has a nose. It's, <laughs> it's, it's that's not right at all. The mole has those teeth. You could do something cool with the teeth. For sure. Naked, you know, naked is yeah. sexy, right? It's not just in mole, it's not just a mole head, it's a naked mole head. Yeah. yeah. Put it in yeah. crocs. All right. I, this is a fun game. <laughs> We're Maybe. glad you enjoy it. All right. Here's the next one. It's only going down here from here, Alski. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> this one's a good one. All right. Would you Ooh. rather have a writing session with Stevie Wonder or with Brian Wilson? I already know my answer. Go. Stevie Wonder. Yep. Same. Oh, yeah. Brian, Brian Wilson's genius, but Stevie, man. I mean, oh. Yeah. Yes. I, I love Stevie Wonder. I've always loved Stevie Wonder. That would just be, that would be like a dream come true, honestly. Yeah. Fair. Same. Yeah. <laughs> Next one. I'm with you guys. All right. Would you rather have to eat an entire Thanksgiving turkey by yourself or eat an entire Christmas ham by yourself? Oh. That, oh my God. It's both, they're both scary. Actually like, <laughs> I feel like if you tried to eat the whole turkey, you'd fall asleep before you finished. Yeah. And the ham, you would just be so salty that you would just puff up. <laughs> you know, like, can you even get through a whole ham? Or a whole scenario. Um, yeah. I'm, I'm going to go ham. 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 Yep. I'm going to go ham. Huh. Whole hog, if you will. Whole yeah. Yeah. Ham. <laughs> All Fine. right. You're welcome. <laughs> Enjoy. As a Jew, I feel like my answer is limited. But okay, anyway, okay. Would you rather play <laughs> aces on children's toy instruments or play aces on instruments you've never played before? I'm going toy. Toy instruments would be awesome, actually. Uh, what is that thing he's blowing into? Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Ryan has one of those. The the automatone or? No, he's talking about the other thing, not the, the automatone. Thing. Oh, what is the <laughs> It's a phone. <laughs> Sousaphone, is that what it is? No, the wait, no, the other one's hold on. Oh, it's a um, melodica, melodica. A melodica. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, I, I have had a friend that that played one of those for me. <laughs> that is that's pretty cool, actually. Uh, I'm going to go children's toys, because honestly, I think we may have used some children's toys when recording Aces. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> children's toys are fun. I have a whole box yeah. of those, just because my kids, I have a huge box of them at home, and every once in a while, I'll get them out and... We'll just have a jam sesh. It's pretty. Funny. I mean, hey, if the Roots can do it, and you know they do it with all kinds of cool songs, yeah. they pull it off. Yeah. But they are the Roots. Yeah, I mean, all, they are the Roots. Like, <laughs> although I've always wanted to play the theremin, I've never, I've never had a chance to actually yes! try it, and I think it would be awesome to try to learn aces on the theremin. I think Does Ryan really, have a theremin? He doesn't. Oh. It's like the one thing he doesn't own. Um... <laughs> Brian. Yeah. All right. Come on. <laughs> Cat Ryan. All right. Cool. All right. Uh, Danica. Yeah. All right. All right. Would you rather <laughs> cover Bad Touch by Bloodhound Gang or cover My Humps by the Black Eyed Peas? Um. <laughs> yeah, this is really interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm showing my grumpiness right now, but I can't. I'm oh, the Black Eyed Peas. Just ugh. ugh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the Black Eyed Peas. I don't. I can't stand them. I'm sorry. Bloodhound Gang. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm going to do a Bloodhound Gang on this. Yeah. Okay. That's the correct answer. Yeah, so. oh, okay, good. I win. Yeah. I'm the one that has a correct <laughs> All right. I think this one is our last one. And we asked it last night. And it went over so well. We brought it back tonight, folks. Would you rather be a reverse centaur or a reverse merman? 
who puts these questions together? Who is responsible for this? <laughs> so it, it, it's the four of us. It's Danica and her husband and me and my husband. We just, we're weirdos. You guys, you need to make a board game out of this and pitch it because this is the coolest game. Like it is so much fun. I mean, fun. I think yeah. there is a would you rather game out there, but mm -hmm. our questions are way better. Yeah. They're way better. Alan and I are going to beat the crap out of whoever made the other one and we'll, they'll be gone. And then you can oh, do whatever thank you. you want. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm cool with that. Here first. Uh, I'm gonna go man, I think I'm gonna go merman. Oh I'm going centaur. Okay, yeah. I, I think can now I would be able to swim and breathe underwater. Yeah, I think that would be cool. I think so. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, that's a good point. I don't get to do what being a centaur doesn't have any benefit. <laughs> you, those legs wouldn't even hold up your what big does it matter. Legs? Yeah, I just said, what does that matter? <laughs> you could win fun. the Preakness stakes. I don't know. But he, here's what I'm thinking, Danica. Are you with me? Their new nicknames for Icarus Bell. Alski is now the merman. <laughs> and Matt, you are now the centaur. It's, it's merman. Yeah. Merman. 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 Thank you for knowing that reference. <laughs> I got the black leather. Yeah. Alan wears toe shoes with his with his merman head. <laughs> hey, my river oh, shoes are gonna work out great. Oh, I'm so That's scarred. So All right. Well, on that Ooh. note.